Hey guys, how's it going? Dylan Northcott here. Um, today I'm just going to talk you through how I do my arch on the bench press, why it's efficient, and pretty much just how I get in position. Um, so first off, the three main reasons why I arch on the bench press. Uh, we'll get the most obvious one out of the way first. Um, pretty much it decreases range of movement. So it decreases the uh, distance that the bar has to travel through the movement, um, meaning that it pretty much makes the movement easier. Um, secondly, when archery on the bench press for shoulder health, uh, you need to keep your scapula retracted and then depressed. Um, this keeps your uh, scapula humeral rhythm in the um, optimal range and it prevents your shoulders from protracting um, and potentially injuring your shoulder. Um, and the third and final reason why I arch on the bench press is to um, pretty much create a rigid body for the for my leg drive to act through to then uh, move from the energy from my lower limbs using leg drive up to my upper limbs to be able to push the bar off my chest. Alright, so that was just an example of my competition bench press. Uh, that's pretty much the maximal arch position that I can obtain at the moment. Um, and now I'm just going to talk you through how I set up my arch position while my setup plays in slow motion. Um, so I'll initiate uh, setting up for the bench press by laying flat on the bench, putting my head under the bar, looking for that equal grip on each side, gripping the bar tight as this is where my hands are going to stay for the entire movement. Uh, the second part of my setup is placing my feet as far back as I can uh, behind my pelvis. Uh, I'll then do a dynamic movement of extension uh, moving forward of the bar. Uh, a lot of people find this helpful in initiating the arch position uh, as shown here. Alright, so now the third part, I'm just going to dig my upper traps and the back of my neck into the bench behind me. Um, while doing this, I'm excessively retracting my scapula. Uh, I'm also externally rotating my arms here. Uh, this is going to help create that depression of the scapula that we're looking for and also uh, creates a bit of thoracic extension. Uh, so right here, I'm placing my feet as far back as I possibly can. Um, moving my thighs to each side of the bench uh, to keep my ass on the bench and to move my pelvis as far back as I can. Uh, so this final part of the movement, I'm about to move my shoulders, upper back and head as close to my pelvis as possible. Uh, this is going to create that final thoracic extension we need uh, to create as big an arch as possible and to really decrease range of movement as much as possible because this is where it's really going to come from. So that's how I set up on the bench press for my arch position. Uh, I'm just going to let the rest of this video play out. If you found this video helpful, like the video, subscribe for more content and thanks for watching.